Hey guys, welcome to my channel, Pendulia Ring. So I just want to go over this topic of John Casablanca that everyone is talking about, whether it's a scam or whether it's a true agency, because I've been told that agencies don't really ask for money. So the first time I went to John Casablanca was like about a week ago, and I don't know when I'm going to post this video. So today is September 5th, so I probably saw them like towards the end of August and then I saw them yesterday and um, the first time I went over there they had people line up and you go into a room and you basically read a script then they send you to another room where you um, take a picture of yourself and see how well you are or how comfortable you feel in front of the camera and then you go into a, another room with everyone in there and you go walk down the runway so they want to see how your presentation is as far as everything mixed up as far as how you're how you're doing in front of a camera how your speech is when you are given a line as well as your confidence when you're going down the runway in front of audience so there's about three, four judges, and by the way, I'm at Co I was checking out Casablanca in Maryland. I'm residents in Virginia, which is about an hour and some change, two hours of traffic, so it's a hike. So anyways, last week I went up and they basically grade you, the coaches grade you um, A, B, C. A being excellent and you've been doing this, you just want to expertise your skills. B being you have the potential in you and you're willing to learn and you're easy, to, you're teachable. C is you're just failing and they, they're not trying to teach you because you're just not mentally, physically prepared at, the, at that given moment. So they put you in another room, um, they put some people in another room and then people that made it in another room and basically they say we want to do a second interview with you. So yesterday was my second interview and it went well. Um, they basically broke down everything that they were going to be providing for you. So basically I feel like Casablanca is an agency slash school, which is proper which is proper because when I spoke to my friend that is with an agency in New York, he told me, no, you shouldn't pay anything for an agency. The agency basically books you, wants you, and agencies are free. So I feel like John Casablanca is a school slash agency. So I feel like John Casablanca is perfect for someone that doesn't have a built resume on acting or modeling, that wants to build a resume, and they actually, from what I, from my understanding, they're actually helping you build that type of um, resume for it to go to um, auditions and stuff like that. Because when you do go to auditions, they want to have a resume. They don't want to have to train you, teach you how to be in front of a camera or how to read your script. So when I was given John Casablanca's um, program, so basically, it's a program, schooling, and everybody's saying, oh, it's a scam, it's a scam, if it's an agency, you shouldn't be paying anything, which is correct, but John Casablanca, I feel like, is an agency slash school, so it comes as a bulk. So if you're already pursuing acting and you have a resume, then John Casablanca might not be for you, but if you have no experience at all, as of myself, then I feel like John Casablanca is perfect for you. So I'm just going to read quickly um, the 30 things that John Casablanca gives you. Um, so you see them about once a week for an hour or two, and it's basically modeling career center, TV print program, 60 hours to 30 weeks. Um, num first week orientation onto the runway. Week two, two slating intro to improv communication. Three, intro to monologues. Four, runway. Five, skincare nutrition. Six, makeup hair for fo photo shoot. Seven, intro to posing. Eight, professional photo shoot. Nine, teleprompter acting resume. Ten, cold reads into improv. Eleven, social media acting resume. Two, twelve, advanced makeup techniques. Thirteen, advanced photo movement. 
14 professional photo shoot, 15 acting two on camera monologue, 16 runway, 17 improv body movement, 18 run, runway, 19 casting, working with props, teleprompter, 20 master photo movement, 21 professional photo shoot, 22 self networking, social media and marketing tools, 23 one, runway fashion auditions, 24 acting auditions, 25 actor reels voice over, 26 master runway prepare for the booking, 27 master acting prepare for the casting, 28 class choice acting modeling runway po posing voice over, sound room, MTM, marketing, social media, etc. 29 graduation, um, general graduation prep, and 30 graduation. So it comes with all of that. And yes, they do ask you for money. It's either payments or, um, let me see. I'm looking tired and like a hot mess, but I just want to let you guys know because I feel like um, reading other people's videos on Casablanca is like either valid or not valid. Like I feel like the people that are saying it's a scam aren't quietly understanding. People are getting shut down by the number of 2100, which original agency that doesn't have the schooling and everything will basically, you already have a resume and everything and they don't have to teach you anything. But Casablanca is more like, we're gonna help you build your resume, we're gonna help you have confidence, we're gonna help you like be comfortable in your own skin before we just throw you out in auditions. So also it is an agency where they give you auditions and they expect you to make it to the auditions and it's up to you whether you get the part or not. But they basically don't want to um, be, an, be an agent for you if you don't have no experience because basically it makes them look bad. So basically before they throw you out into the world of acting and modeling, they wanna make sure that you are fully prepared and aware of what you're about to get yourself into. Not just, boom, you have no freaking experience and we're gonna give you an audition and you're gonna be like looking at the camera like a deer in the headlights. It just doesn't work like that. I feel like people just get shut down once they hear the numbers 2100. The only reason why I feel like I'm like, 50-50 with it is because it's a mission. It's a hike to get from Virginia all the way to Maryland, but they're willing to accommodate my schedule. So I'm also thinking about it. I'm on the fence. Um, it's not the money part, it's the commitment part. And a lot of people that did quit, basically quit because it's a commitment part. It is school. It is training your mind how to act and be professional in front of a camera and some people make it and some people don't. And I can totally understand that perspective, why people can do and why people don't and why people think it's a scam and why people don't think it's a scam. Um, it's something that you have to and not have to, but want to actually do for yourself. It actually has to be something that you want to um, accomplish. If acting and modeling is something that you want to accomplish, classes of course aren't going to be free so this is like a bundle that they do for you and then i want to show you what they say it's like 2150 um if you pay up front um no finance charge unlimited photo shoots for three years that's unlimited photo shoots for three years unlimited workshops for three years so that's continuing your education for three years so when i did the math of three years let's see that's 36 months, so 21.50 divided by 36. So it's basically 60 bucks a month, which is kind of like what you would be paying at a gym membership at like one life. So it's not bad. Um, you do class, I, I saw acting classes on Google, not Google, Groupon, and it's about two, three hundred dollars for 10 classes. Um, let's see, 300 divided by 10, I believe. So it's like 30 bucks. A class um, I feel like if you do pay for something like this this is something that you actually want to do this is something that you actually have to go to to learn and and study the craft of um, being an actor or a model because you can't just wing it some people maybe can wing it but most people 
need to study just like you need to study and learn the craft hands on as being a doctor or cosmetologist or someone in sales. Um, so I'm still thinking about Casa Blancas. I don't think it's a scam because I don't think it's just an agency. I think it's a school slash agency. I, it's something that I highly recommend to someone that has no experience as of myself versus someone that has experience. Casa Blanca might not be for you because you already got a resume. You're just waiting for an agency to sign you. On top of that, you can also it's a it's a no it's it's not binding, so you're not obligated to stay with that agency. And if you if another agency wants to sign you, you can have John Casablanca and that agency. So you have two agents pull pulling in work for you. So I feel like it's a win win. It's something that I'm definitely going to take into consideration because this is something that I want to do. It's something that I want to jump into. I'm also going to see and check out my options. Um, I know that there's DC and Prague. Um, I'm not sure how much it is. I saw something where it's like $60 a year, um, but then you're also paying additional for the classes and you get 10% off. So I don't know how much the classes are going for, but when I saw them, on Groupon, it was saying that it was like, I don't know, like $100 or so, something like that. Um, but it's something that you should take into consideration. I don't think it's a scam. I think it's more like people not believing in themselves, that they're quitting. Um, it's something that you definitely want to do. Anything with classes is not free. I, I, I did piano and that was like an, $100 an hour. You know, I did cosmetology, so that's two years, and granted, it took a lot of studying and practice to pass the test. I didn't even pass it completely the first time I took it. So everything is a learning process, and that's where Casablanca comes into play, that they are basically wanting to teach you the craft that you want to so badly learn and be, be ahead of. That's as far as your career. Any career that you choose, you have to master the craft. You're not just gonna be like, I wanna be this and you got it. No, you have to do the work, you have to do your due diligence to actually master the craft so that you are able to do it good, amazingly. So that is my input on Casablanca, John Casablanca. And um, another thing I wanna read is they their main thing is that they want you to know the knowledge of the industry um which i have no knowledge in the industry some people do and if you do that's awesome but i have no knowledge in the industry so it's kind of like you're paying for a mentorship just like you would pay for tony robbins coach um, co um life coach you know or just like you would pay for anything to betterment yourself physically mentally or spiritually you know um, learning the skills of modeling and acting, modeling runway, photo posing, posing with props, spokes, modeling, makeup application, how to dress for an audition, acting comedic and dramatic monologues, voiceover work, facial expressions, improv, reading off a teleprompter, which I don't know if I can even read off a teleprompter because I can barely catch up with the, um, what's that? The subtitles <laughs> improvement on self-esteem how to dress for a job you want job college interview skills public speaking etiquette public speaking and presentation skills which i probably need etiquette and public speaking presentation skills um agency representation professional marketing materials understanding auditions and callback procedures reels photography talent responsibilities agency responsibilities so basically what i'm saying is which I've been saying probably throughout this whole video, is that if you have the knowledge, then Casablanca is not for you. But if you don't have the knowledge, then Casablanca might be the school for you to um, teach you and, and further education. So I hope this video was a lot of help. Um, and you guys will get from my next video whether I ended up going with Casablanca or not. And if not, then I will let you guys know what my further journey of researching goes from there as far as acting and modeling. FYI, I don't really want to do modeling. I did that when I was younger and um, I just don't feel like doing modeling. But acting, that is something that I want to do. So 
hopefully you'll see me in the near future and thank you guys like and subscribe hope this video was much help for you and hope you have a wonderful day